Hello guys, this is Amos Doll Music and in today's lesson I'm going to teach you how to play the song called Seven Minutes by Dan Lewis. So here we go, I'll be teaching you my favourite section of this song. It goes like this, check it out, it's the chorus section. Okay, very beautiful. I really like this section. Okay, let's learn it right now. So here we go. Breaking it up into parts to learn it. Okay, break it up about, uh, let me see, three parts, all right? First part goes like this, right hand starts on the D here, middle C, C here for reference, go up an octave C, D right here. So it goes D up to F, G, G, F, G, F, D. That's it for the first part for the right hand. Let's do it again. So it goes D, F, G, G, F, G, F, D. That's it for the right hand. Okay. Once the right hand, you got it. Left hand, two chords here, the two chords are E flat major, which is E flat G B flat, and then the second chord is B flat major, which is B flat D F. So with these two chords in mind, E flat major and B flat major. Two hands together goes like this, right hand starts with the first three notes. After G, E flat major by itself, continues. After D, B flat major by itself. That's it for the first part. Let's do it again, so it goes like this. Here. Alright, moving on to the second part, right continues down to the B flat C and then four Ds. One, two, three, four, up to F, down to C, B flat. That's it for the second part for the right hand. One more time, it goes like this, it goes B flat C, D, 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 F, C, B flat. That's it for the right hand. Once you get the right hand there, left hand, two chords, the two chords are F major, which is F, A, C, and then second chord G minor, which is G, B flat, D. So with these two chords in mind, so F major and G minor, the two hands together goes like this. Okay, right hand starts on the B flat C, D and F major together. Up the B flat G minor by itself. That's it for the second part. One more time, it goes together. Here. There you have it for the second part. So back to back, the two parts of float so far will be played like this. Check it out, so it goes. Moving on to the third and last part, okay? So here we go, right hand goes D, F, G, G, F, G, F, D. And then here we have nine C's in a row. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. That's it for the right hand. One more time, it goes D, F, G, G, F, G, F, D, followed by nine C's. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. That's it for the right hand. Left hand, finish off three chords. The three chords are just the same as the kind of like beginning chords. So E flat major, E flat G, B flat. Second chord, B flat major, B flat D, F. And third chord, F major, which is F, A, C. All right, so with these three chords in mind, so E flat major, B flat major, and F major. Turn together, goes like this. Right hand starts, G and E flat major together. Of D, B flat major by itself. Third C and F major to get up. Like that. One more time, it goes like this. To get up. Here. To get up. Just like that. Alrighty. So, yeah, that's that. Okay, so uh, back to back, all three parts will be played like this. Check it out. Okay, 
So yeah, once you get the melody and chords of this right, all the notes of rhythm, then you can start to think of other improvisation and decoration patterns to put into it to make it more awesome. Okay, for example, left hand, you can do like, based on the chords, do an octave bass note followed by arpeggios and the rhythmic patterns, and right hand, you can harmonize it based on those respective chords. So you can be like, do something like this. Okay, and that's pretty much it. Okay, so I hope you enjoyed this lesson. If you did, make sure to check out the rest of my channel because literally I have multiple thousands and thousands and thousands of these videos for you to enjoy and learn from. So most likely you can find your favorite songs to learn on my channel. But anyway, also check out my website, bestpianomethod.com, linked in the description below if you want to learn more piano from me, learn how to play by ER, improvise, read sheet music, play and sing, and a lot of other cool stuff. So make sure to check that out as well. Enjoy your time around my channel, and as for now, see you next time. Thanks for watching. For those who want to learn my methods on how to play any song by ear, grab the free preview of my book. Or just visit my website, bestpianomethod.com, for all my other piano mastery courses, sheet music, song requests, and services. All the links are in the description below. See you next time.